Hey everybody, welcome to the show. It's that time of the day. It's that time of the week. Guess what, Tim? What? It's Friday. Is it? Welcome to happy hour. Whoa, switching it up. <laughs> I was going to zig while you zag. Oh, wow. Man. So I did. Man. Yeah, nice. I know. We just, oh man, we were just having a laugh. <laughs> I'm still recovering. <laughs> About what, Zach? <laughs> <laughs> Whole bunch of stuff. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. Let's never talk about that again. Uh, what'd you, <laughs> what'd you, what'd you think of the show? Uh, the one we just recorded? The, the, the one we just re- Yeah, that one. That was a great show. <laughs> Thanks, man. It really was, actually. It was one of those, let's just call it a palate cleanser, because yes. finally, for once, yes. it was not about people dying or something. People some dying or, or something yeah. awful. Exactly. It was just like, oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe that's why we were laughing after we recorded. <laughs> Because we weren't because, super depressed by the topic. Right, right. Oh, yeah. No, that was good. Glad yeah. to do that. Um, yeah, and again, shout out to the Lynn turn. Lynn, hey, thank you. Go. Kudos. How you doing? Drop yeah. me a line. Um, I think she's doing well. Call the listener line. Call, do you, <laughs> I'm always going to plug your, that. That's your running joke, isn't but it? It doesn't even work. <laughs> Wonder how many people have actually called wanting to talk to one of us. <laughs> Probably three. Three people. Yeah, yep. two of which are me testing it. Yeah, first of and all. I also did as well on the way over. So there you go. <laughs> oh, still doesn't work. All right. Um, riddles, puzzles, jokes. Yes. Riddle me this, crackpot co-host. Yeah. Um, Is that a clue? Yes. Okay. <laughs> you have to decipher the letters and then put it into a website backwards. Done and done. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're recording well, we, right now is what it is. To the next one. Um, yeah. I don't know. I mean, we kind of talked about it on the show, but um, so puzzles, crosswords, yeah. checkers, riddles. I don't know. What, <laughs> what do you? <laughs> What's really cool about this show in particular is like, well, I guess like many of our shows, mm-hmm. there's not an answer necessarily, but also like the amount of work, like even after the, like, like after we would tape the show, we were both talking about how much work went into doing the thing, creating the riddles, right? right for this right. actual, uh, it's ridiculous. Group. It's incredible. And I mean, we kind of probably know the end game, you know, I mean, we're still speculating and going off of people's, you know, accounts and. In all likelihood, they're probably telling the truth. But, yeah. you know, when when this first popped up in 2012, it's like, why would people mm-hmm. go to all those lengths to try to solve these? You know, I mean, they're not easy. They're not something you sit down in an afternoon with a pencil and paper and just kind of like figure out. No, I mean, these are like months and months of working this out to get these. And I mean, there's no like answer book at the back and there's no you know finish line even it's like for what why like why (laughs) i mean anyway yeah well a question that just popped into my brain here is what did they do before computers were so readily available so if they were doing this for Mm -hmm. more than let's just say 10 years even 15 years like how did they recruit good point i don't know skywriting maybe oh man um, that'd be hilarious <laughs> uh yeah like coded messages and classified ads or you know right, I, right. it's a good question yeah i just thought of it yeah Wish what thought do of people it? do before what? computers i think is, <laughs> that's the real question right? the, yeah find out next week on crackpot <laughs> um but no it was super fun to yeah. research and lynn was a huge help with this and it just uh reinforced how stupid i am i think <laughs> i can totally you know and you, i mean yeah. i just kind of glossed over like oh and then they put it in here and they deciphered it but like there's uh really good youtube videos explaining like how each of these steps was solved and it, it's it's mind-blowing it's like super genius level stuff and see i think that's exactly what i liked about it too yeah. which is like somebody actually figured this out yeah you know even when you talk about like code breaking yeah it's like how do you even like where do you where, start, where do you start? Yeah. like right it's i mean so have you ever worked or known uh anyone that's like really smart like really, really I mean, besides me, question. of course, <laughs> that's a very loaded question. No, but I mean, like, you like know, next level, like next level smart. I yeah. know a person actually, you know, him too, who you would never guess, but is next level smart. Really? Yes. <laughs> Indiana. Uh, yes. Oh my God. 
Are you serious? Yes. For Actually, real? Hundred percent. Wow. That yeah. that's impressive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. he doesn't come across that way. He listens to the show. Oh, that's on cool. occasion. That's cool. So he's super smart. <laughs> he's and he's awesome. And Good taste. I still laugh about some of the jokes I overheard him telling <laughs> to this day. And that was what ten years that ago. Was ten years ago. Ten. <laughs> Anyway, uh, yeah, what was my point? Yeah, I mean, basically, like, you don't come across those people very often. I don't come across those people very right, often. But right, when right. you do, you're like, oh, yeah, you're, you're like there. And this is like, I would even venture to guess, like, people that are beyond that, you know, that were able to actually figure this out and had the capability and the time and the wherewithal. And like I said, I mean, part of the mystery is why, like, you know, and, and for what and who and when and how, and I mean, it's, it runs a gamut. I think it's a really interesting show and maybe you have no idea what we're talking about at this point because <laughs> we're being kind of elusive, but uh, tune in Monday and um, I, I think you'll get a kick out of it. Cicada 3301. It's, yeah. it's fascinating. Great, great, great topic. Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, real quick, should put a plug in for the Patreon page, patreon.com forward slash crackpot podcast. We have biweekly regular conspiracy theory topics. And then we also have every single Wednesday, just a uh, lighthearted kind of 30 minute fun, just a regular bonus show. Mm-hmm. Uh, three, five or seven bucks a month gets you access to everything. Check it out. Yeah. Just check it out. Just check it out. Yeah. What do you got to lose? Yeah, exactly. Three bucks? Yeah. I guess. Sure. Well, it's free to go there, so not technically. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> they do have nothing to lose. Cool. All right. No, well, it's fine. That's how that works. It's fine. Anyway, There's yeah. a riddle in our uh, Patreon page. If you played this backwards. <laughs> nice. Yeah. All right. Thanks, everybody. We'll wrap it up right here. See you bright and early Monday morning, 5 a.m. CST, North America, planet Earth. See you next week. Thanks. <laughs>